So after the stroke, we decided that we needed to get some therapy started. Uh, and we got occupational, physical, and speech therapy. One of the things with military families is the moving and always getting new referrals, new authorizations. I was researching online and I found MetaTouch. They could um, really touch on the way we move and we decided that, uh, w that this was something that we wanted to pursue. And so we, uh, we discussed services, talked about different new technology that's available with the hand tutor and the, the 3D tutor and knowing the way that we could go forward with different technologies that aren't typically available at a normal occupational therapy clinic. Okay, there we go. There come your lasers. Now we gotta watch for the asteroids. Oh, sometimes they take so long. Oh, there you open, go. Open, open. There. There you go. Whoa, nice. Clinical OT where we, you know, we take him to the occupational therapy clinic is great because they're trained professionals that, you know, that take him away and they go, they go do the sessions. Tele OT has been really good at engaging, you know, especially, you know, us as parents um, in, in making us active participants in AJ's progress and rehabilitation from the stroke. It's, it's allowed us to be involved and to encourage AJ, as well as to just be part of it with him so that that way he's not, it's not just passing him off to someone else. My name is Judy Rosevere, and I'm an occupational therapist doing telehealth with AJ. The functional goals for AJ is to improve his pincher grasp, which is the use of his thumb with each of its fingers and also his ability to be able to make a fist and hold objects and raise his arm above his head out to the side and use it naturally. The MediTouch um, tutors is that the family has the unit in their home at all times and once the software is on their computers they're able to go on anytime, once a day, twice a day, all day, um, whatever they choose to do to play the different games and we can give them homework sessions at the end of each um, therapy session. And then they have activities that they can do during the week in order to improve. So after each session that we do uh, with Judy, uh, she assigns homework. Um, this can be done at our convenience. So it can be done if we have a few extra minutes in the morning before school. Uh, we can do it in the afternoon right after school or maybe even just a, a short session before bedtime. Um, this works great for our family. We are busy, we have sports and after school activities as well as AJ has um, clinical OT and PT during the week. So we're able to use those homework sessions um, as needed um, to meet our schedules, which has been so fantastic. Um, the brain learns by repetition. So as the more that it practices a new action, the more the brain is able to learn that action and be able to do it automatically.